What a welcome from the fans here tonight inside the ILWU Memorial Hall in Wilmington, California. But we are set for action. PCW Ultra presents All Systems Go. We kick things off with KTG making his PCW Ultra debut against the returning Steve Madison. Let's get things started. Ladies and gentlemen, your opening contest brought to you by Live High. It is a one fall bout with a 20 minute time limit. Your first participant makes his way to the ring from Brooklyn, New York. Weighing 240 pounds, the God JTG. His opponent makes his way to the ring from Tampa, Florida. Weighs 222 pounds, Steve Madison. All right, we are set to go big night of action here tonight for PCW Ultra's All Systems Go. Steve Madison returning, JTG. Makes his debut here tonight. Also on the way tonight, the Ultra Tag Team titles are on the line. The champions, War Beast, defend against 5150. Alex Hammerstone puts the Ultra Championship on the line against Alex Kane. The PCW Ultra Women's title is on the line here tonight. Ruby Ray's defense against Viva Van. The PCW Ultra Light Championship will be contested in a double shot duel. All that and more on the way here tonight at All Systems Go. A lot of fans will recognize JTG as one half of the tag team known as Crime Time. He and the late Shad Gaspar. Brooklyn native, current Los Angeles resident. Told me earlier today he feels like he's got a lot to prove as a singles competitor. He knows there's a lot of eyeballs on PCW Ultra, and this is the place to get that done. Steve Madison, meanwhile, returns. having defeated Stefan Bonner, the UFC Hall of Famer, right here at PCW Ultra back in May of 2018. And Madison has enjoyed quite the career, although maybe a, a bit out of the spotlight. Behind the scenes, he has been a, an important figure in the sport. Trained by Steve Kern in Tampa. Spent time in Florida Championship Wrestling. And when Eddie Guerrero was injured, when he was rehabbing, Madison was the guy who Eddie selected to spar with him, to work out with him, to get him back into ring shape. Of course, that match against Bonner here in PCW, Madison won that by disqualification, but a win to win. Nice counter by Madison. JTG out of the way, the elbow drop. Both men with quick arm drags and both will reevaluate. Neither man wants to let go. Both trying to exert some dominance. Oh, 
Just to give you a sense of the size of both men, JTG listed at 6'2", right around 230 pounds. Madison 5'11", 220. Tug of war on the center of the ring. JTG fingertips out, trying to grab hold of the top rope for some leverage. Pretty impressive show of strength here by Madison. And finally, turns the tables in his favor, knee to the gut, and Madison ready to go to work. Very simple game plan, body slam and then that knee drop, no knee pads either. So bone on bone. Madison very slow and methodical when he needs to be. Nice leapfrog there by JTG. Drop kick right on the button. Sling blade and JTG. Looking off the tempo. And force Madison outside of his comfort zone. A big back elbows. JTG lining up for something big, but Madison sends JTG up and over. And teetering precariously on the ring apron. Madison setting up for a suplex outside in. He might have been going for a brain buster. One of his signature maneuvers that he's put many away with. An impressive suplex nonetheless. And Madison now trying to dictate the pace. Beautiful back suplex. Cover. And JTG out at two. Snapmare takeover now. What does Madison have in mind here? Those big tree trunk legs right over the neck, barring the arm, and Madison really cranking it in. Looking to really soften JTG up. setting up for a sharpshooter. JTG keeping that right shoulder off the canvas. Madison finally turns it over. And nowhere for JTG to go. Trying to find a way out of it. Madison doesn't have it seated in very deep, and JTG able to push up using his fists. Toppled Madison right over. But still controlling the pace. Oh! JTG slammed on the brakes. Connected with the right hand. 
And now looking to get some offense going. Big boot to the face. Oh, and a clothesline. JTG firing up. Another clothesline from in close. JTG really feeling the energy here tonight. Stalking Madison. Rolling around the canvas, making sure that he's out of his opponent's line of sight. Oh, Madison's a big guy. JTG nearly lost his balance. Swinging Uranagi. Cover. Madison out at two. That little delay might have been the difference maker. JTG didn't really have a good grip on Madison. He kind of lost his balance. And you think back earlier in the matchup when Madison had that arm submission on JTG. That could certainly be a factor as well. Razor's edge on the way. No, Madison finds a way out. Ducks a clothesline.